right, hey, what's going on, my barbecue brothers and sisters? Hey, today I'm in my trailer. Uh, in my red, this is this big red. Let me see, big red in there. Just prepping up for my cook. We'll go ahead and start serving this for lunchtime. And I am on my Yoda YS640. This thing is a beast too. I had this about maybe three years or so, so it got some, it got some wear and tear, but just cosmetic stuff, but it's a beast, man. It's like a quarter inch steel or metal. But uh, this thing has been doing me pretty pretty well for the past couple of years. You know, I'm running 275 on my Yoder. And uh, let's see what we got. Yeah, 275 on my Yoder YS640. I might go to 300, but this thing can get up. All right, so I'm doing a hot and fast. Let's do a, a quick sear on my chicken. Cause I got out, let's see, 40 pounds of chicken thighs that I'm doing, but I'm gonna actually do 80. Okay, and the pellets. This is just a, I think this is hickory blend. No, straight hickory. This is what, this is the bag that I use, let's see. Yeah. Hickory premium from Smokehouse, you get it from Lowe's for a 40 pound bag for $12. And that's pretty good, you know? Let's check out this chicken. All right. So this is the first batch. I got a little shadow. But I'm not gonna cook these all the way. It's probably about maybe 145. Because what we do with this chicken, you know, we make Hawaiian, jerk chicken, uh, barbecue, Carolina mustard chicken, Carolina the East and Western, you know, out of this. And I just put a good sear, 135, and that's, that's it on it. Let me back up a little bit. I'm about to pour this out. There we go. It's all in the back. So these are just about where I want them at. Uh-oh. Hold on a second. Turn back up. Okay, there we go. So these are just about ready for me. I don't know how you guys can see that. I probably got some steam on my lens now. All right, let's see. I like, I'm liking that color too. A little bit of burnt. And I think that should be it. Just took all these over. Yeah. Yeah, these are about ready to come off. Let's check it out. Yeah, I think we're done. Pull these off. Well, I'm going to give them another 15 minutes. I'm going to pull them off. Usually, I don't put any kind of seasoning on my chicken, but I got some seasoning that I need to get rid of. Because we just go straight smoke. But when it's time to serve, we put seasoning. Um, when the customer say, hey, they want jerk chicken, you know, jerk, jerk sauce. My barbecue sauce got a lot of sodium. Along with the uh, mustard sauce and uh, Carolina ketchup base. And uh, we do Hawaiian, Hawaiian chicken, too. All right, but this is uh, my long weekender. It's right over here. I need to get on it, but it's, it's been a while since I've been on a long, on a long weekender. Yeah, I might put some briskets on there maybe tomorrow. Who knows? Hey, Kevin, how you doing, man? And if I want to control the heat on this pellet grill, you know, I can have a hot side and I can have a cool side. All I got to do is come over here and take this lever right push it all the way over that means i'm gonna have a cool side from here on back and this side will continue to sear and i also got my you see my searing grates down there too where i can take off this plate that's in here throw them searing grates on there and go straight planes but that's only when i'm doing steaks or tomahawk stuff like that but i'm gonna open this back up right there there we go okay guys hey that's it i'll bring you guys back tomorrow i might put some briskets on a long weekend you know i've been i've been neglecting that one so i need to put something on there okay all right guys god bless and i'll bring you back to my next cook all right